collecting up some information from videos just on YouTube and on Wikipedia and I've managed to gather most of the skills. Now like Borderlands 1, the skills in Borderlands 2 will be split up into three sections and some of those are called Gunlust, Rampage and Brawn. So whilst I talk through the video, there will be some gameplay of Salvador in the background that was shown off at PAX. So Salvador, his ability is to carry two we any weapons from the game. So this will be good for running in and killing and not really thinking about your teammates or your health. So just like from the first one, the skills are in three separate branches and his are called Rampage, Gunlust and Brawn. So let's start with Rampage. The first one is called Inconceivable, and when your health and shield is lowered, it gives your bullets more of a chance to be free ammo. Next one, all in the reflexes, speeds up reloading and melee damage. Next we got I'm Ready Already, and this decreases the cooldown speed of gun zerking, always useful. Steady as she goes, reduces recoil whilst gun zerking, and increases aim with both guns if you kill an enemy. Next one, one of my favourites, double your fun. Instead of throwing one grenade, you have more of a chance of throwing two. Next one, YPKA, and this increases your gun zerking time. That is great for if you just want to keep firing. Last two, five or six shots, killing an enemy increases chance of more bullets being added to your magazine. And last one, filled to the brim, increased ammo capacity and magazine size. So his next skill tree is called Gunlust, and this deals with Salvador's obviously gun side of things. I didn't manage to get as many for this skill tree, but I managed to get a few. So the first one is down and out, and this enables you to use your special ability in the fight for your life mode. So this is the first guy that's been able to do it, so that would be pretty cool. Next one, lay waste. Killing an enemy gives you increased fire rate and critical hit damage. Next one, keep it piping hot. When the gun zerking is cooling down, your gun grenade and melee damage all increase, so that's great. Next one, no kill like overkill, and all excess damage dealt to your enemy is taken on to your next enemy. Last two, auto loader. When you kill an enemy, all the guns that are not in your hand instantly reload, so when you switch to them, they've got full ammo ready to be fired. And the last one in the gunless skill tree is called Money Shot and the last bullet of every round deals a massive damage bonus. So his last skill tree is called Brawn, and this is just really about making him an absolute tank. So the first one is called Asbestos, and this decreases all elemental damage taken. Next one, probably the best named one, Come At Me Bro, and this makes all enemies focus the fire upon you. So if you play with a couple of other people, and one goes down, you can just press the Come At Me Bro, and then that would mean that the other guy to go and save the guy who's down. Next one, inside. And this increases movement and reload speed when you're taking damage. Next one, I'm a juggernaut, and killing an enemy means you take less damage. Just got real, increases weapon damage with all weapons, and the lower health means more damage the weapons get. Next one, sexual Tyrannosaurus. And taking damage gives you health regeneration for five seconds. But this does not happen like every single time that you get shot. The last one, out of bubble gun. And when the shields are depleted, your fire rate increases. Like I said earlier guys, they aren't all the skills from his skill trees. But I will be doing other videos on the other character's skill trees. So leave a comment on which character you want me to do next. And subscribe for the videos as well guys.
sugar. I see you found some fairly fleshy snapshots of me. If you give those to me instead of my third ex-husband, I'll make it worth your while. Feel free to take a peek, though. I sure don't mind. Come <laughs> on. 